Hey viewers, welcome back to uh, Just Cause. Yeah, we haven't touched this in a good probably three months. So uh, we're doing an episode two. And I gotta figure out what the crap I'm doing. Just making sure. Alrighty. So it's right where we left off, I think. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go liberate a town. Actually, I'm gonna buy D delivery. Yeah, that sounds fun. Because, you know what this car reminds me of? A lot of. And you know what Lotta's are? For the car guys down in the comments, you know what country they're from. But for the people who don't know, the Lotta was a Soviet-made car. And this awfully looks like one. And good grief was the freaking Lotta's dog crap. Because it was Soviet-made. And if it's Soviet, I mean, the, the, the only thing Soviets were really good at was killing their own people and making weapons. Except for fighter aircraft for some reason. But they were really good at making guns like the Mosin Gat, the AK-47, and the, the other famous, some other famous guns. Like the Makarov. I think that's a Soviet made gun. Maybe. Ah, oh, crap, I gotta get this thought about me how kind of dumb I am. Oh. Sweet. Alrighty. Man, I really miss that powered wing suit. Because I have every DLC in this game. <laughs> Man, I'm glad cells exist because I ain't no way I was trying to buy all of the freaking DLCs. But I found the game itself and all the DLCs on sale for like five bucks, I think. I don't know why I was on sale for that much, but I'm like, well, it works for me. So, um. Oh, trauma didn't go down? How about now? Oh, that's what we call trauma down. Bink. And that guy was a dead in there. Oh, boy. Excuse me, sir. Oh no. Oh, you're not getting away, buddy. You guys have fun. You see, propaganda is no one's friend. Unless if it's the government, and maybe somehow figure out how to control your people. Or just kill half the smart people. Now, there was a dictator who killed a good majority of the population just because the easiest way to run a uh, dictatorship is to control the people. And he got rid of the smart ones because he knew he can control them as easy. I don't know why I mentioned a history fact for no reason. Don't, um, I forgot the dude's name, but I think, I think he died to some form of karma, like pretty bad karma. Probably died to a heart attack, like most dictators do, I think. You know what's funny? Well, it's, well, it's not funny, but it's just, well, it's funny to me because it's pretty ironic how um, Stalin died. For everyone knows Joseph Stalin because of the memes and the, the history and, you know, evil, like, freaking communist dictator. Anyway, the way he, not know, uh, for the people who don't know how he died, he died due to, I think it was a, either stroke or heart attack, back in like 1951, and what happened was, he, well, he was either having a heart attack or a stroke, and he, the doctors were too afraid to treat him, because I get it, the strokes of freaking Stalin, or Stalin, how, how do you freaking say his last name? They were sure to him because, you know, dictator but likes to kill a lot of people and send them to the gulag. And he ended up dying in his office because the doctors were too afraid to treat him. You see, the best way to lead a country is people that have your back instead of... Uh, you can only control, control a country with fear for so freaking long. Because when they, when they find out... There's better, they can actually do something to, you know, get, 
like revolt and actually help themselves out, then then they're they're done. Cause what who's who's gonna stop them? The military. I mean, they can try, but maybe the military's gonna turn on you too. Dude, it's like you know this guy is a jerk, and um, we don't like him. Yeah, once again, I'm ranting on about dictatorships. Well, it's probably because I'm a proud patriot and I freaking love history. Alright, this is like who you really should have in the game. Okay. Ooh, what's this gonna be? Alright. Semis, he's Lord. Oh, sorry, Sylvie. Get out of what what are you doing in an active war zone? Yeah, I mean, half the stuff I do in this game is kind of a war. Well, he, now that I'm recording, I'm not going to kill as many civilians as I did. YouTube, please don't demonetize that. Don't, don't take that out of context. That was just a good game, bro. I got bored, and besides, half of them took me off in the cars. So I, they hit the freaking hit me while I'm crossing the road when I'm like, no, it's clear that all of a sudden there's one speeding because there was just a random explosion because the rebels were fighting the freaking bad guys and. What are you doing? Don't just stand around there. Get going. Man, that guy's got some nerves. Let's uh, get him kick started. Yeah. Alright. If you die, that's your fault. Because I. Guess that wasn't motivation enough for you. <coughs> Apologize for the cough. It's been a bit down in the weather. Run! Oh, hey, I cleared the heat. Sweet. I have a really light heat anyway. I don't blame you for running. Ooh, oh, I forgot that there was a weapon box. Maybe I played a bit too much of Call of Duty. Oh dear. Hey. Why is everyone messaging me all of a sudden? Wait, what? Wait. Hey, hold on. I'm gonna... Oh, no. Ah, very damn what I've done. You guys just pretend you didn't see that, alright? Yeah, I'm gonna help this guy who... Is out of gas in the middle of the map. Oh, hey, convenient. Where's your car? Of course it's the one. Of course it's like the Honda. And a Toyota. Toyota. Kia Forte. I actually kind of looks like a Kia Forte. Now I'm going to get looking at it. Hmm. Pretty good car. How do I know it's a pretty good car? Well, we have one. That's my brother's. He gave it to us. And it's lasted like a good 10 years now. And it's had some hard miles. But hey, for out of seas. Uh, for out of seas car, that's pretty freaking good. I mean, I think like Japanese cars are actually generally pretty good. The only car that isn't really good from out of seas is Chinese and Russian and. Uh, let's see, what would be another really crappy car brand? I don't think North Korea makes any because of their freaking dictatorship. And like, hey, look, I can do whatever I want with a car. Maybe I can run somebody over it. And then the dictator's like, yeah. But, no, the dictator can be defeated by a box of honey buns. He's like, hmm, you know, we don't like you because you have a car. Now you're going to, you're going to die. Uh, Like, you have a car? You have, you have, like, some freedom? Nah, we don't allow that. Because I'm a freaking dictator. <laughs> I don't even know where I'm going with this. And if, and if you've been, if your family's been affected by a dictator, I apologize. And But if you have interesting history about it, could you maybe tell me in the comments about the history? Because I, I will gladly listen to any stories if you guys got were fled from a terrible country. Or, uh, uh, not, not, not every country's terrible. It's just the people who run them are terrible. If you, like, fling some from something bad in your native country, um, 
I want to hear your stories because everyone's got a story to tell. Alrighty. I hope I don't get hit by fireworks. Wait a minute, how the crap are they coming out of the church roof? Where do you hide your mortars? I think there's mortars in here. That's like a war crime, I think. Yeah, it's a war crime to have military, um, militaries, in, or anything military in a civilian thing like a church, a hospital. Well, unless if it's u being used for medical, then it's not a war crime. But if you're using it as like a... Actually, I don't know what is a war crime. I think... No, using a hospital as a defense post and like holding people hostage, that's... Yeah, that's a war crime. But... Yeah, but if you're like using the church for medical aid, I don't think that's really a war crime. Now that I just think about it. Maybe. Maybe not. You know what I hate? Propaganda. I think... Oh, I didn't even think I was going to hit that shot. Somebody clipped that. Bing, 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 bing. Spawn. Oh, shoot. Ow. Hey. No. None of your stupid reinforcements. Tommy. You were probably forced. I'm sorry, bro. If he had a family, I'm yeah, sorry. But if he was a full on Tommy, nah, I'm good. Nah, he can die. Da 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 Turn in the squish juice and. Hey, come on, let's go. Man, you guys are freaking bulletproof, bro. Not, not, not really intense. I just killed three guys with this pistol. Yeah, and they're calling reinforcements like. No other. I don't. I don't even get what the problem is here, right? Hey! Oh no, no you freaking don't. Wait a minute. Don't tell me that's a black hand. Crap it is. <coughs> Those guys only supposed to come to heat level 5. I, or 4. I mean, depends on the region. But if it's like in a city like this, they should be only coming from um, heat 3 level or heat level Three and, or no, four and five. Man, I'm kind of tripping. Wait a minute. I wonder. Hey, Lord, I kind of sinned. Could you just let me in for a couple of minutes and repent? No. Uh, okay. <laughs> Why are you running? Why are you running? Oh. That's got to be one heck of a coincidence. Oh, alrighty. Uh, uh, don't mind me, I kind of just killed some people like that one guy right there. What would happen if I strapped a soda, like five different sodas to a grenade? Nothing real, I guess it would still kill and then also it would, you know, it would just make a sticky mess. Sorry for the janitor, guys got a clean. Simultaneously, the blood that's been infused with the um, soda. I guess that's gonna be one heck of a sticky mess. Not only does it dry faster now, but it just it's a little sticky. I just have random intrusive thoughts for like no reason. How about you guys? <laughs> you guys have any random intrusive thoughts? Cause. If you if you do just say yes in the comments. I know everybody does. Like they see that small child that nobody likes. Why don't I just throw him in the river and forget about it? Oh yeah, there's that one kid who or I would call what caught fish. Had a bank for a little freaking rock. And then what he said, womp womp. I'm like, how about I freaking 
How would you like a defeat? And he's like, oh, I don't care if you make me lose a fish kill. I'm like, oh, you win. He's like, no, I win. I'm like, all right. Ah, you know, I'm going to be saying to your family when I like when I find your dead body and it wasn't me that committed the murder. Yeah, womp womp. You know, I, I can, I'll be nice to people, but if they're just going to be complete pieces of crap, I'm just going to, I'm just going to be mean bad because. You know, I'm kind of tired of trying to be nice to the world, and then it's just that. Rocket launcher. <laughs> Bing. Oh, green one. Man, you guys have crap aim. You're, you're worse than these freaking stormtroopers, bro. <laughs> I mean, it depends. If it's the real life stormtroopers, nah, they have great aim. If it's if it's the Star Wars ones, run for your life. If it's the if it's the real life ones, run for your life. But if it's the Star Wars ones, nah, don't run for your life. They have crap aim anyway. Hmm. Oh shoot! There's a helicopter. I think there's a helicopter in it. Yes. Hello, friend. You're gonna be my new freaking flight toy. Come here. Wait, why are you smoking? I didn't even shoot you. Maybe he is a smoker. Maybe I'm just tripping. I'll have to watch it. Oh, no, I'm smoking. What the crap? Oh, police station's liberated. Waiter, bro. Like I said, I try to be nice to people, but if they're gonna be a freaking complete jerk, so I'm like, yeah. It's like, like if I if you get killed by someone else, and you know, a little bit of murder, I I don't care. Like I'm, I value human life, but if you're gonna be a complete jerk, I'm like worth being worth nothing to our society. Yeah, I don't care if you die. Really hoping YouTube doesn't demonetize this. I mean, it's not just like kids, but. Mm. Just going back up a few centimeters. Wait, that's like a couple of feet. Oh, they still see me. Yeah, I see this. I probably just killed like. A fa small family of five. Wait a minute. There's no kids in this game. They just. I mean, it made sense because they all they knew the freaking the devs knew that uh, they were everyone was just gonna murder a child in this game. And if they were being annoying, then I mean, I would jump on that anyway. I'm not gonna lie. I'm just letting my intrusive thoughts run today. I've been like. A lot of pain and that. Uh, yeah. You have forms to say. Uh, don't mind if I just disable your satellite communication to like your favorite. Man, if I disable like and then Netty for you guys, I'm sorry. But if it's like something like Bluey that like really kind of ruin your satellite TV, um, I do not care. <laughs> If it's anything new cartoons, like, I do not care. It's the, the good cartoons, where it was at, where it competes with cartoons, is Ed and Eddie, Courage the Cowardly Dog, Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends, the original Teen Titans, the new ones suck, and it's psychological trauma. Um. Yeah, psychological trauma. But anyway, another big cartoon back then. What's, what's another really good cartoon from back then? Alright, just gotta hear me out with this one. The first few, the first five seasons of the original Tom Stick Tank Engine. You just gotta hear me out with that, alright? That was a solid piece of my shot. Ooh, sorry, off topic here. You see these two guys? Draw. Oh, oh, you can get the bullet. 
here's the thing. If you're gonna call reinforcements, I'm gonna shoot you even more than I have to. But I'm gonna make sure you're dead and you ain't calling for your reinforcing your reinforcements. Cause yeah, no. All right. And this is kind of just a rant video now that I get thinking about it. Wait a minute, where's the last settlement? I will find you. I'm gonna find that settlement. I'm gonna burn it to the ground. Oh, not except I can't really burn anything to the ground in this game. Hmm, I wonder what that convenient spot on the ground is. Let's see. I need I need it. Got any good planes? Nope. Nope. Really wish they saved that helicopter from earlier. Let's do it. You know what? You're gonna show up. Uh, yeah, there we go. <clears throat> Land a freaking scorpion. Uh, well, it sucks because of the enemy. I'm about to become a American sniper. Hold on, kill the plane. Let me close. I don't know why I'm ranting so much this episode. I kind of just need to let it out, I guess. Why are you running? Hold oh, still. I'm here. If you're gonna run, don't run into a wall. I should have probably looked up. <coughs> yeah, I did it. You're welcome. Hey, there's a freaking wall. I did think of my marriage in the one more time. Wait. I'm just gonna pretend I didn't say that. And if any of you caught on to what I said, and, um, you're from Mexico going on that, I'm sorry. I'm not sorry if you're legal, but uh, sorry. I should not have said that. I mean, I can probably just delete the video if I get popular, which I highly doubt because I barely, I kind of upload off. I don't have a good upload schedule. And life is just busy. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my life. I'm just hoping I can maybe get far. Maybe not end up like a specific family member. <sighs> yeah, I'm sorry to all the viewers that get offended by that kind of horrible joke that I was about to make. About to make. And if you're from the if you have crossed the border, um, or welcome to the United States, um, if you understand English, but, yeah, sorry, it's just a huge, it's just a huge, if you're outside of the U.S., you would get, uh, if you, if you do research, you would get what's wrong with our country. The two biggest issues in our country right now, the government, and, uh, the border crisis. Primarily the government, because the ATF expanded beyond what they were supposed to do. The IRS, well, it, like, uh, it's it's the IRS. Let, let's be honest here, folks. Who, who actually wants to pay their taxes? Not me, but do I have to pay them? Yep. Uh, and you know what's going towards? Freaking useless everything, because, you know, they just use it to fight each other in Congress. When I could go beautifully into a bridge. I don't know why I would bring up a bridge, but there's probably something we can do better than tax paradox. You know, you know what's the thing about the the government that really ticks me off is they they expect us to follow their rules, and when they're losing like nuclear bombs and you know. 200,000 pound tank called the Doom Turtle by the Fat Electrician. I like that guy. He's pretty sure. 
And let's see, what else did they... Oh, yeah, they lost... Oh, crap. They just lost that one. Hmm. Oh, no. But, I don't know, they lose it. They expect us to follow the rules when they lose, like, $80 million jets and... Yeah, and then they expect us to pay, like, they expect us to find out what our taxes is, even though half of us don't even know how to do taxes, so we end up in, like, federal jail for supposed tax evasion, even though we didn't know how to pay our taxes, because they don't teach us in school. Yeah, it seems, yeah, I mean, they're telling us what we can, what we can't do, and they're freaking doing the thing that we're not supposed to do all the time. Like violate the Second Amendment. That's been kind of a big thing, like down in New Mexico. Hold on, I said I I just do it. I know you don't. Also, if I disappear within the next week, um, that was, that was probably the CIA. Actually, no, it's just a whole entire government. You, you can't tell me otherwise. They're trying to keep everything secret. And when I learned that the, the, the unfortunate assassination that was, uh, John F. Kennedy was an inside job by the CIA, which I, I thought from the memes and some other stuff I saw online. I thought it was a conspiracy theory. And then it ends out to be, it turns out to be true. That, that's concerning, you know? Hey, I can't find a freaking place to liberate. You know what? I go to that's problems. Yeah, this seems like a good place I could pick on. Let's go here. Oh, like I said, if I do disappear in the next week, it was the CIA. Yes, they don't. They don't really like to have their secrets exposed. Yeah, we missed another thing. You know, I've ranted on about how they tell us rules. Here's the thing: Why should be they be telling us the rules when they failed to <clears throat> assassinate a specific dictator up in Cuba? Like, 700 times. But, yeah. Fidel Castro. The man who has survived the most... Like, he has the world record. For most assassination attempts survived. Man, the CIA can't do their job. Unless if it's in the inside of a country, then they can do their job. All depends on the situation. But, dang. But, like, you know... Sorry for ranting on, I just rant. Maybe I should make this into an urban exploring channel. And just go explore abandoned places. Yeah, I don't know. Since I'm just hoping I don't get shanked by a homeless crackhead. That would be bad. Hold on, I, I gotta pull off a meme. Hag squid wait no, that's that's a skill. I Squidward. <laughs> oh, of course, that gives me heat. Oh. Hey. You are not my turn. Get the needle! Oh. Oh, no, you don't. Sorry, Gramps. Well, how are we doing time wise? Oh, shoot. I'm gonna have to wrap it here. Uh, this is more like a rant about how my country can be fired. The USA sucks. Doesn't fully suck because uh, we have good people here. A famous. A thing said by many people, but what my dad told me is, if it makes a bad country, 
It makes an evil country. It's not the people inside it, but the people who run it. Right. It's not the it's not the average people that run it. It's the politics that run it that makes it a bad country. Hey, you might want to watch where you're stepping next time, sir. I'm here, motorcycle. Oh. Oh, shoot. I'm on fire, aren't I? Watch out! Hey, you probably will. Oh, wait, I forgot the... <laughs> All right, where's the next bad guy I can get? I forgot how to sound the dash dash down it. Oh, hold on. I think this is a good sniping view because we only got way in those. Yeah, at least the stun is still. <coughs> Who saw me? Who? And still, sucker. Oh, hold on, hold on. I wonder if I can hit that one. Oh, look at that peak accuracy. Bing, bing, and bing. And how many? How many shots? Gosh, dad. Five shots for my actually six. So that like counted for the damage. Ooh, and I have a boom headshot. Here's the pin shuckle nuts. I have three grenades and you have none. Ooh, that was pretty. Uh, hey. Man, that's a freaking big crater. I want this thing four bores something good for a read. Ooh, no kill point. Yeah, then it's going to wrap it up for this video, folks. Sorry, it's just primarily rant. I didn't have... It's just a free roam, so I'm not concentrating like nuts. Anyway, uh, see you in the next video. Bye.